Hello and welcome to the first edition of Get Your Add-On. In this series, I'll be covering different add-ons for the World of Warcraft. I'll start with ones that I use in my user interface. I'll have a brief explanation as to why I find them useful, sometimes offer alternatives, and sometimes talk about how to configure add-ons if they're extremely complex. With that in mind, we'll start with one of my personal favorite add-ons, Arc Inventory. This is one of those add-ons that once you have it and you're running with it, you can't imagine what life was like without it. It's exceptionally useful and exceptionally powerful, although it doesn't require a lot of setup to use. Normally when you hit the B key, your normal bags open up. But once Arc Inventory is installed, selecting the B key will open up its virtual bag space. At the bottom, you'll see your actual bags there. And the green highlights are showing where those bag slots are but Arc Inventory puts these slots into a virtual organization for you. As you can see, I'm already partially configured. If I didn't have it configured already, then all my items would be in one large area. This area down here. I'm going to show you how to set up other areas. Edit mode is what we're going to do now. Your edit mode allows you to set up different configurations. The numbers you see correspond to virtual bag space that you can use to however you like. I'm going to set up one for all of my potions, elixirs, and scrolls. So I'm going to go to number 5. I'm going to click on number 5, which brings up the menu. Then I'm going to go down and tell Arc Inventory what I want in this bag space. I'm going to go down to consumables, and I'm going to select those items, including my bandages, flasks, elixirs, potions, scrolls. And you'll notice, as I click each one of these, Arc Inventory will start moving those items into that area. Next, I'll move to bag 6, where I want to put all of my food and drink. So again, I go down to consumables, and I select the items for food, drink, and then food and drink. Now when I exit edit mode, it will set everything to where it belongs. And we're back to normal. Whenever you loot or buy a new item, it'll be moved into the large area down here. So I'm going to put items down here to show you how to get them to their proper location going to drag these down here. Once all these items are here and you open your bag, if you're having a hard time trying to figure out where everything belongs, well you don't really have to because Arc Inventory will do it for you. You hit the refresh button and it'll snap everything where it belongs. This accounts for new items. If you get new food or you get new elixirs, it'll automatically put those in the proper categories. Now I'm going to break up some stacks and show you how the restack works. Sometimes you'll get 19 of one item, and then when you pick another set of that item up, you'll have three, which will give you a stack of 19 and a stack of three. This could be annoying, and also it can start to waste bag space if you're accumulating a lot of items. So with Arc Inventory, all you have to do is press the Restack button. The Restack button will automatically make even level stacks of whatever the max size of that stack is. I hope you found this useful. If you have any questions, feel free to leave comments. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you next time on Get Your Add-Ons.